Hi there, I'm Zach from Composition Critiques, and today I'm going to review the Carol G song, Mi Ex Tenia Razon, which translates to My Ex Was Right. This particular song has started across Latin America, the United States, and Spain. And I can understand why, because of three reasons. The first reason is the gorgeous production and instrumentation. Now, it's no secret that the Colombian singer is primarily a reggaeton artist. What I like about her is that she doesn't pigeonhole herself within that genre, as she experiments with other genres. Case in point, this tune, that leads more into the cumbia Tex-Mex territory. In terms of the tropical drum patterning, the slow staccato guitar picking, the solid bass grooves, and the shimmering key tar solo that allows the audience to smile and dance. Also, I want to point out that I heard a lot of people saying that this is a tribute to the late Tejano icon, Selena. And yeah, you can't argue against that. Given the fact that it sounds similar to Bitty Bitty Bom Bom or Como La Flor. Now that's how you pay homage to your influences. As Carol G has stated that Selena is and will continue to be a big motivation factor in her career and personal life. Next we have the pretty vocals from Carol G who is renowned for her low key singing style in order to present herself as a brutally honest woman that doesn't like to be messed with, like in her songs Mami and Teku He. In this song, however, her vocal delivery is a little more passionate by combining her breathy cooing with her nice vibrato, which allowed her sunny disposition on love to be very believable among listeners. Thus, if she sang in the low-key delivery without any emotion whatsoever, then the song wouldn't work at all, as it would clash with the relaxing instrumentation and the lyrical message. Plus, she sang in pocket throughout the whole song. Okay, so she crammed in a few syllables here and there, but you can't deny that she wasn't off-beat. Finally, we have the lyrics that doesn't take jabs at her ex, Anuel Aa, like in Teku He, but makes short references of him, as they are the words of an open love letter to her current boyfriend, Fake. In my opinion, I like the lyrical sentiment of moving on from a past relationship and finding happiness in a new one, as it shows how willing and mature Carol G is. Not to mention that many people would relate to this as they find joy in new relationships that are better than their old ones, despite what their exes say. Overall, I enjoyed this song for the summary production and instrumentation, Carol G's joyful singing, and the love struck lyrics. For more music reviews like this, Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Also, drop a comment below on what other songs and artists you want me to review next. Thank you, and take care.